Hi guys, I'm Katniss Everdeen. Just kidding. I'm Caitlin Anderson, but my favorite movie is Hunger Games Catching Fire. Hunger Games is basically a series of games where they take 12 districts under the tyranny of the capital Panem, and they take a boy and a girl from each district, and they all kill each other until there's one person left. In Catching Fire, the previous winners, Katniss and Peeta, go on a victory tour where they basically give their condolences to the other districts who lost loved ones. And while on this tour, Katniss has a feeling that the districts are starting to rebel. So President Snow has to prove that he's still in power, so he declares a 75th annual Hunger Games, except this time, instead of picking new people from districts, they have returning winners go. And all in all, they all kind of end up just teaming up at the end and rebelling against the Capitol in the arena because we all hate President Snow. Catching Fire is honestly just the best movie in existence because it, it just gets right to the point. We already know what the Hunger Games consists of. And on top of that, the most important part, Jennifer Lawrence is a babe. Bring it in. We need to talk about this. Katniss Everdeen, AKA Jennifer freaking Lawrence, is the best person and character in all of Hunger Games. On the real though, I love Katniss Everdeen and I love her character. She's so strong, she's a fighter, she's passionate. She loves her family and everyone around her and she would do anything to protect them. And honestly, she's all around just a, just a baddie and who doesn't love that? President Snow is the worst and my least favorite character in all of Hunger Games. He simply doesn't care about anybody besides himself. He kills innocent people all around and he really needs to shave but don't tell him I said that. The most iconic scene and my favorite part of Catching Fire is the end when Katniss Everdeen ties the electric wire that's connected to the tree around her arrow and shoots it into the force field when the lightning strikes, boom, crashes the whole entire force field. And the scene ends with her laying on the ground. They zoom into her beautiful, scarred, scratched up face. And basically the force field just crumbles around her. If you want a lot of action and a little love, I definitely recommend you watch Hunger Games Catching Fire. It foreshadows the next two Hunger Games perfectly and it follows up the first Hunger Games great as well. And honestly, you're not a real Hunger Games fan if you haven't watched Hunger Games Catching Fire.